We are doing whatever it takes. It's about giving your all. From the players on the field to the members in the stands. Do whatever it takes. Call one 300 go bombers down here at Gosh's Paddock today for training. How are the guys going so far since they returned? Yeah, look, they're going terrific. You know, I guess we've been in a probably fairly heavy running phase for a period of time, and now we're in December really starting to ramp our footy up, and um, the guys are really embracing it and, and training to a pretty high level. Can you take us through what they did do in the lead up to Christmas now and then sort of when they come back? Yeah, I guess it's really now a phase of getting them really conditioned to football. You now we've done a fair bit of our conditioning, getting them strong, getting them fit. Now it's about really conditioning them footy-wise and really lead into our January period. So, um, you know, that, a lot of the hard work is, has started, but the real hard work starts now. Who out of the guys have been pressed so far since since they returned in November? Well, I think it's great to see Tate Pears back out on the track. You know, we didn't haven't seen a lot of him over the last couple of years, but just to get him back out on the track and training and doing every session is uh, really good for the footy club. You know, Tommy Bell Chambers has come back in great nick, as has Heath Hocking, and, and they're both training the house down. You talk about the training, we've done a fair bit so far, the, the Gold Coast and Colorado camps. How do you sort of maintain that momentum of such a positive start to the preseason? Yeah, look, I think it has been. It's been slightly disjointed with guys being away, but we really brought it together in the Gold Coast. And, you know, they're a pretty driven group. So you know, we've got three weeks leading up to Christmas. We're going to go pretty hard for those three weeks, and then they'll get a good spell and uh, very good come January. On that Gold Coast camp, we introduced uh, six new draftees. How have they fit into the group? Yeah, look, I think it was a terrific induction for them to come up to Gold Coast, spend some time away from the, from Melbourne with the whole playing group in a in a training environment, but uh, also a social environment where they got together a lot. Um, you know, they have impressed. They're all really highly talented players, and you know, looking forward to seeing them develop. And there's a number of guys, we've got one selection left in the pre-season draft count, there's a number of guys training, how, how have they been going? Yeah look, it's, you know, it's really important for the club to get this right, you know, with our pre-season uh, selection, you know, we've got a spot on our list um, and you know, we've had some guys here training, they've been outstanding, you know, there's no doubt they're all very highly talented players, all, all unlucky to miss out on the draft, but in saying that, um, we've got a tough decision of picking one of them. Thanks for your time. No worries.